VBA. Control shift enter or a macro wave. Well, there's my G on the CSE. Billy J getting down with the VBA. Oh my, it's a dueling XL guy. Stand by, it's a dueling XL guy. Oh my, it's dueling XL time. Hey, there you go. What a catchy tune to get caught in your head, huh? I want to thank Sylvia Juhas for that amazing new theme song and animation. A lot of good sports in there. Chris and Minda, uh, Rick, Jordan, and Oz from Excel TV. Uh, great music. I've heard that music for a while now. Sylvia, Mike, and Val, and uh, illustrations by Chris. Uh, what a cool theme song. So thanks to them for putting that together. And Sylvia, the creative force behind it. Uh, you remember Sylvia from Santa Baby. And Sylvia is an amazing Excel as well. Uh, so, hey, it's time for another Dueling Excel podcast. I'm Bill Jelly from Mr. Excel. I'll be joined by Mike Gervin from Excel This One. This is our episode 165. Look up to find three cells in a row. So here's a, a doozy sent in uh, from YouTube. Is there a way to have Excel take three values from three separate cells side by side, Joe, Mo, and Bo, and search for values in a matching list? Uh, they have to be in three consecutive cells. So we want to find these three names somewhere in that list. Check this out. We're going to do equal match. Match. And what are we going to look up? We're going to look up the concatenation of these three cells. All right. And where are we going to look? Uh, this is crazy that this works, but sure enough, it works. My lookup array is going to be this list here that starts in row seven, joined with this list here that starts in row 8, and that has to go down one below our data, joined with this list here that starts in row 9, and it goes down two rows below the data, and we want comma 0 for an exact match. Of course, that didn't work. F2, press Control shift enter though to force it to be an array, and it finds it Joe, Mo, Bo right there, number 2. Let's just try uh, something else. We'll copy these three cells and paste special transpose. Click OK, and it finds it in the list. Wild, wild, wild that you can build a uh, lookup table using concatenation, and Excel did the right thing. All right, Mike, let's see what you have. Mr. Excel, that is unbelievable. That is the greatest point in all 165 duels that's ever been assigned. I cannot believe it. What is so amazing about this is you took boom, 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 three different starting positions, F9. So it's all one thing. For each one of these, it's three in succession. And right there, boom, one thing. And the thing about your solution that's so amazing is it works no matter if there are duplicates. Here it is, the first time in dueling Excel history, I do not have a solution. I do not have a way to do it. I've been trying and trying, and I don't have a way to do it. I tried to go boom, 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 and, and show all three numbers in the cell. But guess what? It doesn't work when there's duplicates. If I put Joe here, it doesn't work. It, it's showing 1, 3, 4, and that would tell me, oh, it's not in succession. But right below it, it is Control Z. And then I tried something ridiculous like this, and that doesn't work without duplicates either. So what am I going to do? Nothing original. You get all of the points ever awarded for a duel. I'm just going to redo yours because it's so amazing. Equals match, boom, ampersand, boom, ampersand, boom. And comma, you did something really cool. You did this all with arrows. I love this control shift down arrow, ampersand. And then you did this one. And I couldn't believe this. Watch, control shift down arrow. And then you did something secret. You let go of the control key and did shift arrow to get one below. That is like magic. And then you went through the third one on the list, control shift down arrow. You let go of control and boom, boom with the arrow key, comma, zero, close parentheses, control shift, enter. That is amazing. All right, um, I'm throwing 165 dual points back to you, Mr. Excel. 
Woohoo! 165 points. All right. Hey, thanks, Mike. That was way too generous. And, you know, I have to love uh, that Mike can detect the keyboard shortcuts that I clearly do not even realize I'm doing. Control Shift down arrow, Control Shift right arrow, let go of the control key and go to more using just the shift key. That's one of those things that's built in. Like, I don't even think about doing it. And it reminds me of when I'm out doing seminars, I occasionally run into people, you know, so you do a little formula here and you need to copy that formula down. And I always show that by double clicking the fill handle, right? But then you get the people who are like, oh, no, 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 that takes way too much time to reach for the mouse. And they can just, without even thinking about it, do control C, left, con control shoot I can't even do it control down arrow right control shift up arrow control V but they can do it like lightning fast we actually should have a, a contest where people send in their YouTube videos of them doing that very trick just to see who can do it uh, you almost have to have a GoPro and like slow it down to watch how fast that is all right well hey Mike uh, that was a uh, fun dueling Excel podcast I want to thank everyone for stopping by we'll see you next time for another dueling Excel podcast from Mr. Excel and Excel is fun Hey, let's roll that uh, video from Sylvia one more time. Thanks to Sylvia Uhas for this great uh, Dueling Excel theme video. For new laws for VBA, control shift enter or a macro way. Well, there's my G on the CSE, Billy J getting down with the VBA. Oh my, it's a Dueling Excel guy. Stand by. It's doing Excel time. It's my mind. It's doing Excel time.